Hello everyone, my name is Henry Lugo and today we're going to talk about the connection of the men and nature. And we're going to talk to if the men really lost the connection to nature. Maybe do you remember playing outside until mom called you for dinner? But today kids wasn't. The National Wildlife Federation say that in the last two decades, uh, children had moved indoors. The average years, American boys or girls spend a few, only three minutes in instructor other plates a day, and more than seven hours in age from an electronic uh, instrument or electronic screen. This shift is high profile impacts the wellness of the national kids, child obesity, Race had more than doubled at the last 20 years. The United States be has become the largest consumers of HSD medication in the world. Our kids are out of shape, tuned and stressed out because they're missing something essential that they have developed connection in a true world. But what happened with the kids? What happened with the boys? What happened with the mind? What happened with the spirit? Older play increase in fitness levels and wills activity. Healthy bodies and improved strategy in helping the one in three American kids who are upset get fit. Spending time outside rises levels of vitamin D by the sun, helping protect children from future uh, bone problems, heart diseases, diabetes, and other health. Being older improves distant vision and lowers the chains of nerve disease. What happened with the mind? Exposure to nature settings may be while an affecting and reduce ADHD. A school with environmental education programs score higher and exposure to environment based education significantly increasing students' performance on tests, their critical thing skills. Even with the spirit, children's stress and fall down with only a few minutes outdoors or, or green space. Uh, play protects children's emotional development and nature makes you nicer, feel better and feel more relaxed. Um, get better relationships, not only with nature, even between another children. So, what is the real problem? These days we seem to be pulled into everything. Handle mobile, Wi Fi platforms are making it possible to stay connected everywhere. Take a moment to reflect on your daily life and determine how much time do you spend in front of a computer or a phone or watching television or texting or blogging, Facebook or whatever. Now subtract the amount of the time you spend sitting outside, walking in the woods, gardening or other interactive with nature. The result is your natural deficit. The bigger the natural deficit, the more all balance it with the life force to nature world you are. All living things are connected by the life force to flows and throw them. Imagine this connection as billions and billions of tiny wet link fibers in tissue impression. You can begin to understand how we are interviewed. The problem continues when the men start to lose the connection with the nature and start to destroy them to replace with artificial things. So, what is the solution? Rural or urban cities? indoor or outdoor. The solution is started when you find a balance between outdoor and indoor activities. And how do you spend your time in, in important things and how do you don't waste your time in other things.
Do you have benefits living in a city? Of course you are. Do, do you stay more connection? Uh, do you have more access to different information? And a lot of benefits relationship with the daily problems. But what about living out the city? What about living connection with nature? We mentioned a lot of good things happen when you live in outdoors or spend more time outdoors in your health, in your mind, in your body. This reflects how do you act and how the nature acts on you. Finally, can the urbanism be stopped? According to the FAO for the 2015, the rise of humans can be increasing to about 9 billion of people in the earth. So personally, I think the urbanism can be stopped. But the solution isn't stop the urbanism. The solution is find a equal situation, find a, a moment and a time to spend more time connecting with nature and use the nature in the right form. Thanks everyone for watching and remember the connection with nature.